So there's a new Gatsby image called the Gatsby plugin. It can be challenging to manually add responsive images to your website while retaining excellent performance rankings. Luckily for developers, the new Gatsby image plugin takes care of those difficult elements of creating images in a variety of sizes and formats for you. Built from the ground up for speed and best practices, the Gatsby plugin image is the most performant way to use images in Gatsby. It simplifies the GraphQL API for images to make it easier than ever to use. By automatically executing image optimizations for your site, your users will be able to view your content-rich site. The plugin includes two components to display responsive images on your site. One is used for static and the other is used for dynamic. So static image is used for static images. It should be used if the image is the same every single time the component's used. So for example, uh, a common static image might be like your site logo or your index page hero. Gatsby image, on the other hand, is used for dynamic images, and it should really only be used if that image is passed into the component as a prop or otherwise changes. It is best for images like a blog post hero image or like an author avatar. Here's one note though. You might wonder, isn't this the same old Gatsby image I've heard about before? The answer is no. Gatsby plugin image is not the same as Gatsby image. Awesome stuff like the static image component that I mentioned is not a part of the original Gatsby image and you can only get it with Gatsby plugin image. If you're using Gatsby image, not Gatsby plugin image, you'll wanna make sure that you change the Gatsby plugin image ASAP in order to get those high performance responsive images every time. You can find Gatsby plugin image on GitHub and NPM now.